Hi everyone, it's Gail, and I am back from my from my week-long retreat. And guess what was in the mail when I got home? Yes, the new Blue Fern Studios um, collection. It's called Life's Vignettes. It's designed by my pal Jen Bishop. And there is so much to this collection, you guys. I'm so excited to share everything with you because I haven't looked yet myself. So we'll look at it together. Let's see. I wanted to tell you a couple of things, share a couple of things um, from Susan and Ann at Blue Fern Studios. Um, they've had a hard, hard time getting the paper for their collections, you know, supply chain issues and all of that jazz. But, um, so that this has finally come through. So that is awesome. Uh, let's see. Um, oh, this is a fun little fact. All these pictures are of Jen's mom when she was a little girl, which I think is really cool. And along with the main collection, she says they've added an eight and a half by 11 journal pack and, um, and then millinery packs with trims, embroidery pieces, and buttons. So there's all sorts of fun things to look at. Um, let's see. Yeah. So then the other thing is Michelle Singh, who also designs for Blue Fern Studios, will be releasing a new collection as well. They're hoping for June. Depends on the supply chain issues. So as usual, I think we'll look at the papers first, just so that we can see how everything else will, will mesh into the papers. Oh, <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. I can't can't hardly stand it. I'm tossing things on the floor. Okay, let's get this out of its packaging. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so fun. Okay, I haven't figured out what my project's going to be for this for this collection yet, but you know, something is going to come to me cuz Oh, look at that. You know, once again, I will say it again. The, I think the magic of Jen's papers are, or her designs are that there's hundreds of layers to these. I mean, it's just amazing. A layer upon layer. Look at this one with the text and the lace and the flowers. And then just the color pieces. There's a different texture over here. I'm telling you, there's just so many layers to these. Oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, wow. Oh, I should tell you the names of the papers. So this is Life's Vignettes Memorabilia. This is Catalog. This is Life Vignettes Dream of Joy. Oh my gosh, they're stunning. Oh, geez, Jen, I tell you, with every collection, I swear she outdoes herself. It's just incredible. This is frayed damask. It's almost got like a little, a little jean, um, like a pair of jeans type of background to it. So cool. Look at that. Hmm. She's one talented lady. Journal de Paris. There's that cute little mom of Jen's. <laughs> this is so cute. She's got the pipe in her mouth. It's so funny. I have to tell you, I have a picture with my dad's pipe in my mouth too. Must have been the age we, because her mom is the same age as me about. <laughs> so fun. These are gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Linen and lace, this one. I am taking my time, aren't I, looking at them, but I just have to. The other thing I love about Blue Fern Studios paper is the, um, is the strip here is, you know, is uh, patterned so that you can use the branding strips as well in a project. 
scattered dreams. Mm. Wow. Wow. Just beautiful. Ooh, look at that one. Scripted archives. That could be a traveler's notebook cover. Thank you, Jen. <laughs> I gave Jen our, well, so could this. Look at this one. This could too. I gave I gave Jen the, the the little request from the journal makers that the right side be um, such that we could use it for a journal cover. It's just going to be hard to know which side of which side to you know display as the um, as the main one. This one's called the daily. That's a great piece for a scrapbooking layout, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. <sighs> we're ha we're taking a little trip to take Alfie back to back home today. So my brain is just going to be clicking along with what can I make out of all these gorgeous papers. So that's the paper collection, the 12 by 12s, just to kind of give you an idea of how you know how everything else fits in um let's look at this we'll just start going through the pile of yumminess this is the ephemera pack 28 die cuts let me get this kind of up to the camera so you can see a little bit frames and flowers tickets stamps all sorts of fun ephemera there okay and then this one this is the journal cards. Let me get that, pop that down. Bits and bobs. There's 24 four by six sheets. So let me just show you kind of, there's some pictures. There's some bookmarks. There's these little pieces to cut out. And then, you know, and then the journal cards themselves, little tags. Gorgeous, gorgeous. That That's so fun. Oh my goodness. Oh, and then we've got snips and snaps. <laughs> That's really fun. So here's some already die cut card stock shapes. Lots of shapes of the of the little girl and then butterflies and some labels, word labels. Wow, this is fabulous. Okay, and then here's the 8 by 8 version of the paper. Of course, it's the very same um, the very same paper. There's 20 double-sided designer pages. So, you get two of each design, which is awesome because, you know, then you can use because we struggle with which side to use otherwise. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, let's open this one up because this is a, something kind of new. It's a journal pack, they call it. Oh my gosh, look at this. So a couple of fun little um, additions, the stamps, which is what they were talking about in their letter. Let's just pull these out and look. Oops. So here's the stamps, pipe full of dreams. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. And then this little chipboard little girl. And then let's take let's take a look at the paper. I'm so interested to see. I'm going to move this over, guys, just so that I can I can kind of show you this easily. Oh, so there's pieces on the back. Awesome. Oh, look at that. That'd be fun to use. Oh boy, the brain is working overtime. So then, okay, I see. So it's almost like a digital pack. I mean, it, it really kind of is like a digital. So um, for those of you who don't have a printer in order to print digitals, this would be a great, great solution. Look at these. Oh my God stars oh my stars so pretty oh my gosh 
these are awesome now for me because the back is white what I would do just to just to let you know what I would do is cut off the edges put these together I would just put like a little bit of glue right there pop this on so it's straight and then I'd sew around so then I've got the two sided just to give you a little hint of how I how I would handle these for a journal how I would and probably will <laughs> handle these oh gosh these are just gorgeous mm. wow I think I have it upside down. That'd be me. Wow. I mm, love the lace too. Here's an envelope. How gorgeous are these? I am just like, that is so beautiful. Wow, wow, wow. And there's that one. And then this one. Oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful? Oh wow, absolutely stunning. And what a fun, fun idea for a new product, I guess you could say. And that is the journal pack. So we've got 12 journal sheets, three envelopes, a three by four stamp and a chipboard piece. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Okay, um, I'm just gonna set this over here. It won't take time to put it back in the package just now. Okay, so there's that. Then look at this. Wow, 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 wow. They've, they've slipped a little bit. I see that there's pieces that have slipped. This little butterfly should be over here. But look at this set. The um, millinery pack is what you, millinery? You know, as usual, Gail doesn't pronounce things right. But anyway, trims, <laughs> trims, embroidered pieces, and buttons, little charm over here. That's fabulous. Okay, and then let's see what we have over here. I'm just going to go one by one as they are. So uh, we've got charms, butterfly charms, little, little flower charm. Gorgeous. This is, oh, and this is called, let me tell you, Winged Fancies. This one, mini masterpieces. So they're little charms where you could put a picture in there. This one, blossoms charms. So there's some book corners and then flower charms. Can you see those okay? I just hold them like that. Let me get them up a little bit. So those are the flowers. These are the mini masterpieces. And this one is the winged fant fancies. So those, this one, I'll stand up and do this book smart. And some little labels, or you know, uh, what do you call them? book plate? Book plate? I don't know. Little frames, little frames for on your book. <laughs> let's see. Um, let's put. Okay trying to group them together a little bit in what they are okay okay all right so chipboard pieces look at the little girls oh my gosh those are so sweet so sweet this one called Bess and Tess Bess and Tess so so girls this one posy corners so it's it's slight it's slid a little bit let me let me see if I can just pull this. So I want you to be able to see the shape of these. See? Little corners. We've got scattered wings, butterflies. 
And this one, the little butterfly is separate there. Um, the scroll Damask. Isn't that beautiful? Wouldn't that be beautiful on a cover? And then this one is Portrait. So gorgeous chipboard pieces. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then let's get into stamps here. We've got Chantilly. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my gosh. Oh, this is cool. Background stamp illustrations. It's like the, the, the catalog paper. Okay, and this one, Dream of Joy. Yes, love the background of that. Oh my goodness. Moment in time. Gosh. Just going to have to have a stamping day just to try all these stamps. Journal to Paris. So gorgeous. Okay, and then we have lace. Lots of lace oh, and trims. So velvet trims. We've got like a navy blue, a beautiful pink, and a black velvet trim some gold lace oh let me tell you what velvet trim pack this one lace 80 you can see it right there this one bl the black one lace 81 you can kind of see that this one um lace 83 i love that i find so many uses for that thin lace and then this one, Lace 82, which is gorgeous as well. Oh my gosh, you guys. So this is the new collection from Blue Fern Studios. It's called Life's Vignettes. It is designed by my friend Jen Bishop. Amazing, amazing. And so... The awesome thing is it's like there's so many products that there's everything you need to create amazing things. <laughs> so I will have links in the description box of where you can can get these things. Um, there's a variety of Etsy's uh, and of course you can get them on Dreams Etc. Uh, which is uh, Jen Bishop's uh website and store um and uh i was going to tell you too another place is uh blue moon scrapbooking and um they're actually starting a brick and mortar store so they're going to have a store it's opening may 26th and 28th and i think it's in the phoenix area Susan and Ann, correct me if I'm wrong, because um, I'm not for sure. But uh, yeah, there we go. There we go, guys. It's the new one from Jen Bishop, Life's Vignettes. Yeah, go get yours. <laughs> I'm going to have so much fun playing with this. So thanks, everybody, so much for watching. Thanks for um, all your support of Blue Fern Studios. Uh, it is... It is I dare say the best quality scrapbook paper out there. I absolutely love the weight of it. It's it's unfortunate that at this point in time that they're having a little bit of trouble getting the um getting the supply of this paper, but it's incredible. And they're doing the very best they can to keep us supplied with things to inspire us. So thanks, Blue Fern Studios. Thank you everyone for watching. Have a grateful day, and we'll just see you in the next video. Bye!